Hello y'all, welcome in Crochet Life and Stuff with Deborah Presents Book Look. But as you may have seen from the thumbnail, this book look is a little bit different than just a book. But I include it with book look because I ordered it from a used book place. I ordered this from A Books back when there was a sale. It was $1.99, plus like $3.99 to ship. It was less than six bucks. This is what I'm talking about. Crochet characters, fun and furry animals. Oh my God, so cute. 12 different designs. You get the stuff to make two of them in here. And uh, I got it from A Books and it is perfect. There's nothing missing. Perfect shape, the box is awesome. And let me show you this box, it's kind of cool. It's got a little magnet doohickey there. You flip it up and what? You've got your book right there. Let me see if the book will come out. Yes, yes, the book slides out of a little en envelope thingy right there. And you get this little pattern book. That's a lot of stuff, look. Ooh, a lot of patterns in there. This is by Kristen Rask. And here's your table of contents. Look at all of the things you get to try to make, okay? And I say try because for me it is a try thing. A bear, a cow, a monkey, a kitten, a chick, lamb, bunny, pig, dog, koala, alpaca, and mouse. Oh my gosh. Look at how stinking cute that is. Really. They are adorable. You get step-by-step -step instructions, including you know, what to do with your hands and how to do it, even a slip knot at the beginning. So this is geared towards someone who needs some help, who does not know how to do things. They're explaining single crochet here, um, which I do have a uh, crochet from the beginning, a little mini series. I'll try to remember to link it up there. It's a playlist that I have done. But they do explain a bunch of the stitches. Let's see what the first one is. I got decreasing all kinds of stuff about how to crochet stuff in here. That's pretty awesome. The first one is a bear. And they tell you a little bit about who actually designed each one. It's a collection. Uh, this one is by Victoria Rodriguez in Texas. Oh, that is so stinking cute. You get all of the instructions. Oh, look at that little guy finished. Oh my gosh, I can't handle the cuteness. I mean, seriously. Here's the cow. Oh my God, the cow is adorable. Um, let's see. And boy, they really do. It is pictures about everything. I'll look a little more of a close up of that little guy. Dorbs, dorbs. That does qualify as dorbs. And so does the monkey. Look at that guy. And it goes through everything telling you how to do all of these things. And the kitten. How sweet is that? You know, I love anything cat and kitten, so. The little chick. Little chicky doo. Oh! These would be so cute. Some of them just, you know, put them in like. Easter baskets or anything like that. The little lamb, oh, looks so fuzzy. How adorable. And there's another picture of that little lamb. Just a little round puff ball. What that little dude is, adorable. The bunny, that is super cute. I can't help it, they're all super cute. The pig. Always reminds me of my grandmother because she used to collect things with pigs. She also collected lighthouses, but pigs, and we would get her things with pigs. And that reminds me of something that I would have made for her had I crocheted at the time. This is the dog. Look at the doggy with those long ears and the long snout. That little guy is full of personality. Oh, oh my goodness. what they mean by puppy dog eyes you know absolutely the koala is adorable little fuzzy white ears there and I'll show you what comes in the kit in a second because it does come with more than just the book alpaca yeah I don't know what that was all about but the alpaca is adorable 
Alpaca needed an intro, didn't it? Okay. Getting towards the end of the book. But I know that there's more. The mouse. That's a cute little mouse. It looks like the mouse is hanging on to some cheese there. Mm-hmm. Nobody moved his cheese. And if you know what book I'm talking about, welcome, you're old, like me. Okay. Um, oh, you've even got some templates back here. Okay. Because some of the items you cut out of felt, they give you the templates. Like Xerox that and so you don't have to cut up your book or trace it or something and cut them out that way. Fantastic. All kinds of, you know, bits and bobs about, you know, acknowledgments and, oh, we thank you all so much. This was put out in 2017. So it's something from Abe Books. It's not really old. I mean, 2017 was like yesterday, right? Yeah. Um, but that is a nice comprehensive book of a lot of things to make. Now, what comes in the kit? I think you'll be pleasantly surprised. Look at this. It is a box full of stuff. Now I'm going to open it up. You get stuffing, little polyfill. That's always helpful. You get some brown yarn. No, it's not the softest in the world, but it's for a little amigurumi. It's not to, you know, wear as a scarf, okay? Little gray. Can't help it, I gotta squish it, it's yarn. Little bit of white. I'm not sure which two you get the stuff for to make. I'd have to look and see. But in addition to all of that, you are getting a four millimeter crochet hook. Not ergonomic, so I probably wouldn't be using that. That would hurt my hands in about five minutes, but it's cool that they give you one. And, and you get the felt to cut out the eye pieces and stuff with it that you need. You also get safety eyes and is there a safety nose in there or is that just eyes? I'm not sure. I'd have to dig into it and look. There's also a darting needle tucked in there in between everything. So you literally have everything you need except for the scissors um, to make something cool, to make two cool things actually. I have to look and see which ones. But I thought that was really neat. And how I find these things on A Books, I just search crochet kits. And sometimes you just get, you know, books that aren't really kits, you know, because people tag things funny. But sometimes you luck out and you find something super cute for like hella cheap, okay? Yeah two dollars plus shipping less than six total less than six dollars total for this kit and even if you didn't pick it up for yourself you could pick this up as a gift for somebody who you know um likes to crochet a little bit maybe wants to make some other stuff but you know doesn't know where to start with it give them a kit let them play let them have fun i'm putting all these things back in the box so i don't lose things because i do tend to lose things tuck that little guy right back in there and let me tuck the book back where it goes there's a little envelope on the side a nicely put together box actually nicely designed see there's a little envelope to tuck that book into and close it up a little magnetic closure boom book look or project and book look today. Thank you for coming by. Uh, if you're not subscribed, I would love it if you would subscribe. Um, let me know what you think of book look. Let me know what you'd like me to look at. I do have other books on tap uh, to look through and, and see what's in there. Uh, not just kits, books too. And um, a lot of other content as well. I do thank you for coming by and taking your time to hang out with me for a little while today. And I hope that I will see you very, very soon. Bye, y'all.